In this video, we will uh, set up a small application in Redux uh, with the aim to give you an overview on how Redux works. And I hope you will uh, realize how simple in reality Redux is. So first thing from terminal, you go to the directory where you want to create your project. We'll first create a directory called Redux app. Then we go inside the directory and we run the command npm init to create the package JSON file. Then we open with Atom and you can see that uh, the package file is already in there. At uh, this point we can move installing webpack. Then we install Express and then we need to install uh, Bubble Core, Bubble Loader and all uh, necessary preset uh, ES2015 and Stage 1 and React. Finally, we install Redux. We now uh, can start creating all uh, necessary file and folders. So we create server.js, webpack config.js, we make a directory public and a directory src for our source file. Then we could go inside the public folder and create the index.html then we go back to the main directory and go inside src we create uh, the app.js uh, file so we have all project files in front of us we can start editing index.html it's a normal html file uh, that has a head with a title uh, we write uh, hello redux as a title then we have a body inside the body we will have a div uh, for our app so id app and a script uh, linked to the bundle.js file and finally we can write an h1 hello first redux app okay we can now open our server.js file and we start uh, writing a use strict directive to make sure you receive an error in case uh, you use any bad uh, syntax then we require express and path and then we write our first middleware uh, for defining a folder for static files or images and then we need to catch uh, the main route and send back as a response index.html file finally uh, we set our web server to listen on port 3000 and we can run this to make sure it's working uh, run with the command node server.js we got an error here because uh, in the terminal we were still in uh, src directory so we need to go back up uh, one directory 
to Redux app. And if you run node server.js, everything is working as expected. Now, in order to complete our setup, we need to configure Webpack. So we open Webpack config. We require path and Webpack. Then we make our module available with module.exports. We define an entry, uh, which is the path of our app.js file. We define the output file. We set uh, watch to true. So every time we save a change in uh, one of the files linked with uh, app.js, Webpack will uh, recompile the bundle automatically. Then in module, we define our loaders. And the first uh, thing to do is to tell Webpack to scan all JS files and to prevent a long compile time we exclude all js files inside node, node modules finally we tell webpack that we want to use bubble loader and as preset we want react es 2015 and stage one now, in order to see if you brought everything correctly, you open terminal. Actually, we need to open a new terminal windows. Otherwise, we have to stop uh, the web server from running. And from the new window, you go to your app directory and you run the command webpack.